everyone, how you doing? Welcome to Game Tech UK. Welcome to uh, more Forza, more Forza Horizon. We were playing this last night, um, and for some reason, um, in my mind, I kept saying it. In fact, I said it a couple of times in the stream. Wouldn't it be great if they had a Capri? Uh, and I thought, hang on a minute, and I saw Radar pull up, and he had a bloody Capri, and it was like they'd just literally, whilst I was streaming, installed special dlc <laughs> and made a capri specifically for me i'm like oh my god there's a bloody you, 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 yeah you can't do that um you can't do it can you because it's all desktop capture on uh forza bloody thing um so i thought what i'll do is today i'll buy a capri now i asked radar where he got his he, he says he got it from uh the horizon site i can't find one for sale I brought one, um, I brought one from, um, it was harsh, yeah. I brought one from the auction, which will probably unlock an achievement for me anyway. But I couldn't find, um, I couldn't find one for sale in the store or anything. But I've got this one, apparently it's rare. Let's have a look. Look at this little beast, oh my god, look at the interior, look, look. And it's got the hockey stick, it's got the gold Irish stripe. It is a three litre beauty. Look at the wheels, look. Look at the wheels. This is this is like a dream. This is like a dream come true. This is awesome. So I don't know if I'm going to keep it that colour, um, but that's that's the one. I mean, look at it. Look, it's three litre as well. And what I love about this game, they've got and, and rightly so as well. A game like this, if it's front wheel drive or rear wheel drive, it always um, will spin on what it's meant to. Obviously, that's that's a that's a given. But it's cool, and it? it's still cool. Look at the way it, look at the way it drops. Look. <laughs> right, yeah, you need it in beige. No, nah, not a free leader, not a free leader GT. So what we're going to do today, it's not going to be the longest stream today, because it's only going to be about the Capri. Um, I'm going to go and do some upgrades, try and get it competitive. I don't know, I think this is in, in D class, I don't know if I'm going to keep it in D. Might even, um, nah, that was the Mark 3 Capri, this is the Mark 1. Um, but yeah, we can still have uh, professional music. Wow, wow, wow. The dashboard stayed exactly the same from the Mark 1 all the way through to the latest um, Mark 3s. How are you all? Yeah, there's no intro um, on a Forza stream because of the way that um, it won't capture to my proper streaming program. Um, so I can't do any... any uh, uh, yeah, it's boring, but yeah, I don't want to bore you with the details, but it's fine. It's fine. Please leave me a little cheeky like to make up for it. Um, and we'll have a little play in the Capri today. So I'm going to be streaming for about an hour. We're going to do some upgrades. Have a drive around. Um, feel free to uh, feel free to come into the uh, into the uh, the thing. Although actually it's saying unable to join. Let's have a look. So if we go play online, drive through some boxes. Yeah, definitely. Yeah. There you go. You should be able to. If you want to join me today, um, you should be able to. But what a fantastic little game this is. Hello, Jasha. Now, we should be able to get some roundabout action on this, shouldn't we? We should. Yeah, we're definitely going to be able to get some... A yeah. <laughs> How are you all today, anyway? <clears throat> so, yeah, we're going to do some upgrades. Maybe do a little bit of tuning. Have a look and see if they've got any um, any body kits for this. Hopefully they have. Yeah, feel free to come into the thing. The only thing I'm worried about is when I go into the upgrade section, it might kick you all out, you know, for inactivity. But we'll um, we'll just have a drive around for now. Hopefully we'll meet up. Yeah, this is my Sunday driver, this one. Look at it. Hello, Gaz, and hello to everyone that's come in. I do appreciate it. I'm going to be streaming only for about an hour this morning. Uh, more Kelly Brook than Kenny Blom. <laughs> yes. Yeah, you wouldn't say no, though, would you, Graham? So, yeah, probably only about an hour today because I'm only going to be working on the Capri. So, I'm just going to. Um... Oh, it's lovely, isn't it, John? Have you got it, John? Or are you going to get it, did you say? Don't forget Game Pass. You can get it on Game Pass for like six quid. Um, try it out for a month, see if you like it, along with all the other games on there. But yeah, it's it's awesome. And one of the things I like is the fact that it's autumn for everyone. It'll be winter in two days, so the whole server will swap over. 
um, to to winter, and then we'll be playing in winter for about a week, you know? Any car Harry Styles owns, I wouldn't be seen dead in. Nah, of course you wouldn't. You'd be, you'd be seen dead in Harry Styles, though, wouldn't you, Suzuki? Yeah, you like that, did you, guess? <laughs> I love the way all the leaves, if you look behind, they all come up, which is just fantastic. It was really good last night, we had loads of people in the convoy, I thought it was awesome. Our radar's here, this, um, can you see on the map where you're... No, you only see a dot, don't you? Yeah, you only see a dot. I'll tell you what, it is a little bit disappointing how small this map is. Um, <laughs> yes, yeah, Suzuki. That is the only that is the only thing I'm not happy with about this game. I know Phoenix, no, in game. In game. Who's that behind me? Oh we got Luke. Come on, let's get a convoy going. You'd like to think that um, an old Capri would be one of the barn finds, wouldn't you? Maybe it will be. Maybe it will. There's a board up here. I'm just going to go and get that. You know what I'm like. Oh, there goes me, me new paint. I can see it from here. <laughs> oh, for fuck's sake. Oh, good. Hello, Bethany. How you doing? There's Matty B, there's all the lads. Barn find Tipford. Oh, what, there is? No, fuck off, Suzuki, there ain't. Matty's got his as well, look at this, look. It's not a Capri, mate. Can everyone just get Capris and really make me happy? This would be like the old days. It's a lovely um, replica, isn't it? It really does look the bollocks. Yeah, everyone get Capris, come on. Hello, Shogun, how you doing? <laughs> Here's my horn. <laughs> Pretty much sums me up, really, doesn't it? <laughs> oh, yeah. Oh, Gavas are here. Gavas are here. <laughs> I think this this bit is just fantastic, you know. I really where you meet up and have a drive around. Hopefully they uh, make it so you can have maybe just a bigger convoy. I'd love that, you know. I know, yeah, that's what we should have. One day we should, well, one one day, one day soon, we're gonna have, um, yeah, an old school old school convoy, Capris, Escort, Sierras. Yeah, definitely, we will do that. Yeah, definitely, hundred percent. Is Radar. Radar's got one. Yeah, fucking hell, he nearly took the side off. Yeah, Bethany, the map, it, ultimately, however much fun this game is, and it is a lot of fun, and like with a lot of games, you can make your own fun, which I respect a game for that. But ultimately, the playground they give you is just a little bit too small. Yes, we've got DLC coming, but not everyone's going to buy the DLC, so that's going to, that's going to, um, it's going to split the player base, isn't it, really? Or have they given us like car game crack here? A lot of people are going to buy this. They're all going to have that feeling of it's too small, and they're all going to buy the DLC. I, my guess is that if you buy this game, you probably buy the DLC. That, that would be my guess. <laughs> now, if I keep doing it, someone will gift that. Yeah. Oh, that's a shame, don't know. Don't worry, just join again. Right, I, I, I don't, I'm just happy driving around like an absolute loon, to be honest with you. But we will do something in a minute. Where's the lads going? We will do something in a minute. Look at this, look. Oh my God, look, we got the Capris out. Yeah, this is, this is it, isn't it? Well, Bethany, was that as big as we remember it, though? That is the question there. Or is that, nost is that nostalgia pumping in? Because that, that game is quite old now, isn't it? Was it as big as we remember?
<laughs> I think Matty's there somewhere. <laughs> That's all right, don't know. Uh, I'll be streaming tonight as well. Yeah, we'll be streaming tonight. That will be um, Forza. No, it won't be Forza. Shut up. Shut up. It's going to be going. It's going to be Gran Turismo, and that's it. All right. Right. What I'm going to do is I'm going to go um, and do some. I'm going to polish that dent out. I'm going to go and do some upgrades. Actually, I'm going to get this board. Can you see that behind me? Yeah. There is one more board here. Look at this little village, though. It's awesome, isn't it? Yeah, Mark Free Capri Shogun, yeah, definitely. Sierra Sapphire, oh my god, yes, yes. Oh, it's that bloody one again. That's gonna haunt me forever, that is. Look at it, how the fuck, you know? Seriously. One, if you're gonna go up on the roof, you're probably gonna go up there just to nick the lead. Not put a fucking sign up there, you know? Wow. Right, let me go to one of my houses. <laughs> oh, come on. Let me go to one of my houses. It's quite hard to... Get to the fucking house. All right, we'll go. We'll go to another one. That won't stop me. Where's my other house? Here it is. Oh no, that one's for sale. That one's for sale. Where's my other house? Is that my other one? No. I don't want to buy a house. I've definitely got a couple of gaffs. Active perk. Visit to move in. Yeah, let's go there then. All right, I'm going up there. Let's um. If we do that, I can press that, and that puts a waypoint for everyone, I think. Not that you're all coming back to my ass. Oh, who's that? Uh, Lewis has got a Capri as well. Look at this, look. He's absolutely ruining that. Um, Got Autumn, yeah, only but Oh, Autumn only barn find. Oh, nice. Who'd want to go to a house on a menu? I know, Scarab. Like, no, you can. Yeah, yards. can you? <laughs> I don't know. Right, steady little cruise now. You're all coming back to my gaff, and we'll do some streaming there. All right. Turn left. Yeah, it says in the menu how long um, it's left. Two days, I think. In 200 yards, turn right. This this part of the game, uh, I can't even describe it really. Just driving Turn around. Right. If you if you look if you think back, do you mean for fuck's sake? I put a waypoint. <laughs> You're ruining my car. If you think back to Gran Turismo, you know when we do the uh, parades. I love it, don't I? I get like fuck it. I love that you're just driving around. I, I love it, you know. And this car allow this um this game allows us. Fuck's sake, classics, mate. Absolute classics here, and we're just fucking, fucking them up. That's what we're doing. No, I press Y. Um, this one is a Mark One. I don't know what the FE one is. No, if I press Y, Scarab, then that will work for me. Man, he's giving it large, isn't he? Look at him. Always look left and right. It's fine. <laughs> Hello, Ines. How you doing? <laughs> it's a proper playground, isn't it? That's what I like about it. Oh, for fuck's sake. Whoa! <laughs> and the other good thing is it doesn't matter if you hit each other. You do that in, in, in Gran Turismo tonight, I'm going to be royally pissed off. In here, it doesn't matter. <laughs> Add a, a Nova, yeah, Voxel Nova would be good, yeah, yeah. Oh god, everyone had a Voxel Nova, didn't they? I didn't, but yeah. In 400 yards, Calibra would be good, yeah. Right. Yeah, yeah, Phil, you got a good point there. You, you know, yeah, you have got a good point. You have. Um, but I think driving-wise, this has got a must. Obviously, it's got real cars. It's got a much better. Um, it's got much better physics in it. 
than what I remember of um, yards, GTA, but I, I take on board what you're saying, and to a certain extent, yeah, you're right, because you can fuck around, can't you? Turn but this is just fucking around with cars, I suppose. That that would be the that would be the difference there. <laughs> Look at Lewis, he's <laughs> This is this is almost a bit like it's a car culture game. That's what I like about this. It, it's a bit of a that's the best way I can describe it. It's got a bit of car culture about it. Look at the cars we're driving, you know, and I'm quite passionate about these cars. It's not just like, oh, you know, I don't know, a bit like Gran Turismo, oh, I'll take the BMW GR3 out. You know, you don't really, you, you know, this is a bit more deeply about the cars, I think. I don't know, you'll have to let me know what you think. For me, it is. <clears throat> I like I like owning these cars, um, and I want to tune them all up. I want to be able to say, right, Capri's lads, let's, let's get in there, get the RS out, all ready to go. Um, uh, what I would rather have, though, is um, is some kind of virtual garage to show this off. I'd like a virtual garage um, where you can yards. show off, say, 12, 15 cars and have your favourite cars uh, and invite people in to have a look around. That's what I would like. Yeah, exactly, Shogun. Well, that that is the problem. We're not all gonna we're not all gonna agree on that, are we? Got the gavers chasing me. Remember, Anis. Remember, I'm not going to say anything. Read out any words. Do you remember me saying this? I'm sure you do. I'm not a parrot, am I? <coughs> Yeah, I saw that, Graham. That would be a good one, yeah. Yeah, that would be... Uh, the Zonda would be awesome, wouldn't it? Thank you, Scarab. Right, we're going up to my gaff now, and we're going to do some upgrades and then bring this puppy out and then maybe do a few races only short stream today and it is all about the capri so in 400 yards it's all good turn sharp left see you later ns <laughs> what the fuck <laughs> turn sharp left oi lads this is where i live up here we can't just go around here fucking screeching around Jesus Christ, we've got a, I, I live up here. In 200 yards, turn left. Turn left. I like the way you just go straight through the wall. <laughs> <laughs> Absolute madness. In 200 yards, turn sharp right. Yeah, Shogun, yeah, I remember that. It was good, wasn't it? Turn sharp right. It <laughs> comes to a bad influence, I think they might be, yeah. Right, so I think it's D class. I might upgrade it to C class and put a bit of power and grunt behind this little baby. 400 yards. Turn left. See what body kits they got. I wouldn't mind completely fucking it up and putting a body, body kit in there. You'd never lend your car in real life to Joel, would you? You just wouldn't do it, would you? Turn left. <laughs> you actually get sparks off the uh, the bricks when you fly through them. Lovely scenery, though. Well, I, I, I've pressed um, I pressed a button um, to do it to the whole convoy. You, see, you should see it, Sam. Yeah. Now, when I go into upgrade, I've got a feeling it's going to say you're going to time out, you know? So, if so, don't worry. We'll start again when I've, when I've done the tuning. Um, and then... Uh... <laughs> <laughs> right, shush. It's the neighbours up here, right? They're a little bit funny, all right? 
They're a little bit funny. I paid a lot of money for this. What are you talking about, Anis? What are you talking about, Willis? What the fuck? You Why would I need to kick you? You know? No, Phil, it's alright. It handles alright. Yeah. Anis, what's going on? Um, do you have to be uh, have a BR? No, what happens is, Drum, um, you have to... Um, why is my... <laughs> Can you... You're ripping up me front fucking garden, mate. <laughs> Oi! <laughs> Hang on, I think you've got to press it at the entrance, haven't you? <laughs> fucking hell. <laughs> no, if you, you have to play the first chapter of the game. When you've played enough and gone through enough seasons, you get a little cutscene that says tells you about how online's going to work. If you haven't seen that cutscene, you're not ready to play online yet. I know, Robbo. I mean, I just fucking got that done, you know? Right. Um, have I come to the wrong place? Can you upgrade here? <laughs> oh, shit. Upgrade the tune. Oh, yeah. <laughs> yeah, exactly, Codus. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, right, okay. Custom upgrades. Here we go. Let's go straight to the body kits. No fucking about. No fucking about. Front bumpers. What have we got? Yes. Hmm. Okay, so you can debumper it totally. I do like a debumper, actually. I do. Can you move this car around if you, as you do it? Can you move it around? Oh, you can move it around. That's good. Um, okay, I do like the debumpering, I must say. Yeah, no worries, John. You crazy kid. <laughs> right, okay. Let's, let's decide. Let's, let's do bumpers first. I think... Probably that. It's debumpered and it's got the spotlights and it's got a little lip lip underneath. So we're going to have a bit of that. No bumper, what a chav. Yeah. Uh, now we're going to go to the rear. Yeah, we've got to debumper that as well. Fuck it. Right. And the rear wing. This is gonna. This is gonna hurt. Ouch. Uh, I quite like that. It's sort of keeping the style of the original, isn't it? But modernising it. Oh, shit. I don't know. I don't know. It's, it's kept... The, what I like about that is it's kept the absolute line. I mean, look at it. Look. Look at how faithful that is. It's kept it, but... Oh, I don't know. I don't know. What? Take it off? No, oh, I don't know about that. It needs something. It needs something. Hello, Sniff. How you doing? No, I like the fact that it's kept the original line almost to the point. Almost to the point. Yeah, let's go with that. I'm going with that. Fuck it. Put a gear sticker on there. <laughs> <laughs> Crappery gear. Right, that's the appearance done. That's the appearance done. So we're going to... We've debumpered it at the front. A few spotlights. Oh, yeah. And at the back, yeah, don't message me on there because you know it's going to come up. We just message me in the stream. It's all good. Um, right, that's that. So let's go back out now. Let's do wheels next. Let's do wheels. Let's see whether there's anything that takes my fancy. I don't think there's going to be. I just don't think. I don't think anything can touch the real, the real deal. The real wheels. I mean, there is always that though. <laughs> <laughs> nice one, Roy. Yeah, welcome, mate. Welcome. Now, we can make these bigger. One of the things that's making it look a bit shit is they're still on their 13-inch um, rims. I think we can make the rims bigger. <laughs> I know, Codus. Yeah, I know. I know. It's got to be original wheels, isn't it? That's the only problem. It's got to be original wheels. Oh, me right-click stuck down. It's fine. Yeah, I think it's going to be original wheels. I really do. Oh, God. They're like bloody Lamborghini Countach wheels, aren't they? Yeah, I don't think anything is going to cut the original wheels. Of course, yeah, I'm working as well. This is me working. This is me working. We're all working together. Codus is working, aren't you, Codus? Right, now, I think I'm going to fuck around. I'm not going to fuck around with wheels. Right, that's that. So, front rim style. Oh, you can change... The Oh, here you go. You can make them bigger. Yeah. Oh, my God. Look at that. 
Look, at, and it weird how the rim size completely and utterly changes the style of the car. It's like I found some some wheels that have kept the original style, but a much much bigger. I think 19 inch on a Capri though. Fuck it now. Really like that though. Yeah, really like that. So standards are 13s as I thought they were. Um, gross. <laughs> Jason Kaz, yeah, exactly. We're, I'm definitely going bigger on these. I'm keeping these wheels, and um, I want to go bigger. Fuck off, Jake. Um, you dirty bastard. Get <laughs> fucking coming in trouble in my stream. Fuck it. Um, yeah. Right. Okay. So we'll go um, 16 inch. I think we'll go 16. Can someone ban that prick? Not for that, for a previous comment. 16 inch, we're going 16. Let's have a look. Oh, that, now we're looking sweet on there, aren't we? Look at that. Let's get me right click in here. Yes. Happy with that, everyone? 16 inch? That doesn't look crazy, does it? I mean, it looks really, really nice now. Um, let's go to the engine now. So we're in. We're in D. Let's take it up to let's take it out to C class. So let's um let's add uh <laughs> fucking I'm laughing but <laughs> fucking <laughs> Right, let's take that up. So we're gonna do uh we've done the air take upgraded in that. Vinyl roof, yeah, why did they die out? Because all the rot used to get inside, wasn't it? I did have a vinyl roof and I took it off on one of my Capris. My first Capri was a Mark II. Uh, yeah, there is, there should be, no, there is an XR2, there is. There certainly is in Forza 7. Um, my first Capri was a Mark II. Let me just get my aircon, it's getting really hot in here. I think it's Jake, he's really, <laughs> I'm just joking by the way. Not worth a time of day. Right, here we go. Yeah, my first Capri was a Mark II. I couldn't afford a Mark III. I had to buy a real cheap one. Now, the Mark I was beautiful. The Mark III was beautiful. The Mark II with the square headlights instead of the two twin headlights. It, it just wasn't a Capri to me, and I couldn't wait um, to get a Mark III. Uh, right, okay, so we definitely need a big throttle, throttle body. We're definitely having that. Toyota MR2? I'm not sure, actually. I'm sure there is. Carburetor. Now, that is one of the things you... <laughs> Honda Jazz. <laughs> I've seen your Honda Jazz, all right? We don't want it anywhere near the stream, Codus, all right? Yeah, Capri Mark II. It wasn't all that. It was a bit of a weird time for Capri. Street Carburetor. Sport Carburetor. Race. Now, that's going to take us straight... Oh, we're already in C, aren't we? Oh, it's already pushed us up right up to C. Okay, well, we're going for C now. Yeah, she's lovely. Ah, oh, Brooklyn's Capri. Brooklyn's 280 Capri. Cause it, yeah, beautiful. Dark green. Brooklyn's green. Yeah, beautiful Capri. Beautiful. Uh, fucking hell. Don't start me on Capris. Don't, because I'll be on eBay after this, and I can't afford a Capri. My wife would kill me. She doesn't kill me for much. But if I was to buy a Capri at the money they are now, she would kill me. Um, yeah, that's a no. <laughs> I had a Capri laser. I had a 1.6 laser. Um, <laughs> I had a 1.6 laser. It was on a D reg, 1987. One of the last Capris that were readily available. Because after that, um, E reg, they started. They they were they were brought up for collection, you know, for people's collections, and they're put, they're reaping the rewards now. I had one of the last D regs, right? It was beautiful, honestly. This this fucking, um, it it was lovely. Um, oh, what was the blue? It was something like, thank you mate for subbing, it was something like, um, oh shit, I just, I, I know the name of the blue, like something like Caspian Blue, it was beautiful, yeah, blue, it was lovely, right, and I had a, I had a mate who worked at a local little uh, garage um, called Tarot Tops, right, and what they used to do is, they used to, um, uh, they were a leather, leather upholsterer, um, and about a year into owning it, um, he said, look, someone's come in and asked, thank you for subbing, mate. Um, someone's asked me to build a Capri full leather set, which I've done, and he never come back. And, you know, Capris were definitely out by that time. It was all, it was all enthusiasts only. And I can't remember how much it was. It was something like, he went, I just need it out of the workshop, 150 quid. No, it wasn't Cayman Blue. No, definitely not. No. Um, he said it was like 150 quid. I'm like, fucking hell, this is a brand new Recaro 
fully recovered leather for 150 quid oh my god i thought i was the bollocks i used to just go out and sit in it like that just sit in it and there's a put my head to the side and smell it oh it was fucking beautiful right so at, at this point i had a d-reg capri that was absolutely spotless fucking loved it with a full leather interior right you you would think that i would leave it like that wouldn't you you would think that that would be good enough i had them wheels on it the proper um rs wheels on there you'd think that was fine wouldn't you nah my mates started to get BMWs, right? Uh, yeah, more sniffing, exactly. Uh, and I and I couldn't. I mean, I, you know, back then I didn't have any money, um, and I just couldn't afford anything else. So I thought, I know what I'll do. I'll jazz this up a little bit. I'll fucking jazz it up. So I got what was effectively a Tickford. Um, if anyone knows the Tickford, very boxy body kit, and I put a whale tail on it. I've still got the picture, I will show you one day. Uh, so I'm now driving around in a full leather 1600. I took the 1600, do you know what I did? I put this, I took the, I'm talking about 18, 17, 18 now. I took the 1600 sticker off and I put a two litre sticker on there. Like that's gonna make much difference. And uh, so I was driving around in a fully levered up, um, fucking Tickford body kitted, but not very well with a fucking whale tail on it thinking i was the absolute bollocks oh my god <laughs> i put i put i rebadged it to a two litre fucking brilliant the things you do when you when yeah come on when you're young i'm talking no i wasn't 17 that's too young 18 maybe 19 about a year or so before i met my missus the tickford grill it was just completely flat when it shogun um but this one bowed out a little bit but it's fine i i couldn't see the bowing oh i did i done fucked it yeah yeah definitely i will have to show you a picture right anyway let's get back to this that was yeah it was my little um uh confession there let's go race exhaust these were always fucking overheating so we're gonna get um we're gonna get five horsepower out of the race oil cooling no nah, no baseball cap no nah. Oh, you're joking. RS3100 on eBay for... F oh, fucking hell. That's crazy money. But actually, Drum, if you're on eBay now, have a look. How much is the cheapest decent Capri? I don't mean necessarily one like that, because that is going to be loads of money. They're all in the eight and nine grands now. They really are. They're all, all classic cars now are going through the roof. Um, when I first met my wife, um, I'd got rid of the Capri. Uh, I've moved from the Capri to an Alpha... Um, Alpha 75, 3 litre, a V6. Fucking monster. It would wheel spin on the motorway. How I'm still alive is unbelievable. Rear wheel drive, <laughs> me and my mate used to drive through our local high street, drifting around the corners. Fucking wankers. We used to come around there, he had a BMW, and he used to, <laughs> we had like a one way system in our local high street. And uh, <laughs> he would he would drift around first, and then I would get to drift around afterwards. <laughs> this is so bad. Looking at people's reactions from him <laughs> fucking drifting around the high street, and then I would come around and do the same thing. Pathetic. Oh, up to wanker. If I saw someone doing that now, I'd pull over and just get their ch keys and just chuck them up onto a building. But when you're 19, 20, things are fucking so different, aren't they? And my, <laughs> my mate's BMW, um, <laughs> his, his accelerator cable broke once. Um, and to get it home, we had to bodge it. Right, we tied um, a cable from the bonnet um, to his carburetor, just propped the bonnet up a little bit out the car and into his uh, thing it was like a string and he pulled the string like this to rev it was only to get him home and <laughs> we went around the high street and he still drifted <laughs> even though he was just pulling this cable and he still drifted around fucking hell a oh, 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 couple of cocks honestly absolutely <laughs> Exactly. Well, imagine uh, Alpha 75, um, 3 litre V6. It was so powerful. It was crazy. But you couldn't go too fast because it would break. <laughs> oh, God. Push up on the D-pad. What, now? It's not doing nothing. Yeah. I know. I know, Pete. I know. Just kids. Absolute kids in, in, um, in fast car or faster cars. Yeah. Right. That's the engine and oil cooling. But I'll tell you what. We had some fun. <coughs> Alpha GTV. I tell you what, I would have another Alpha. I would because they were bloody really, really nice cars actually. Um, but back then, they weren't really reliable, were they? 
just send me a friend request and join in. I'll, I'll, yeah, just join in. Everyone else just joins. Just do that. Right, brakes. Okay, um, that's fine. Efficiency. Yeah, well, let's let's get up there. We definitely want this. So that was my bit of conf confession. Yeah. <laughs> I've just done some stupid thing, but when I look back, I am quite angry with myself. But um, no one was any in any risk. I knew that car inside out, and I, I knew that particular corner. I'd never hurt anyone, honestly. <laughs> this one time at band camp, yeah, exactly. When you're making, um, let's get that friend request. Send me a friend request now, and I'll add them all now while we're here. Hopefully, that's it. Yeah, do it now. If you've got a friend request, do it now. When you're making choice on parts. Oh, I see. Yeah, yeah. Okay. Yeah, yeah. I got you. So, 183 horsepower. Fucking hell, that would be nice, wouldn't it? Yeah, I had this problem with my Alpha, and it was to do with the the diff. Um, so noisy, so so noisy. Um, when you're going along, it. But I just I just put up with it in the end. It was fine. Ride height. Oh shit. Do we want to go that? Oh, look at that. I like that. Yeah, because the back is a little bit higher than the front, which really suits these actually. No, no. Yeah, I'm going with that one. I'm going with that. That looks lovely. <coughs> no, definitely Codus, honestly. Uh, you know, I could handle that car. I could. I could definitely handle it. Yeah, no, I was alright, Codus. It was definitely alright. I might not be that good in Gran Turismo, but in a real car, I was alright. But yeah, 100%. I would literally kick my own ass if I saw myself doing that. Imagine it. Right? You're down a local fucking high street. All 19 year old. I, exactly, Codus. But, you know, yeah, whatever. Going down the road. He comes down in his fucking 3 Series BMW. Completely sideways. And then I get to see the reaction of people like, What the fuck? And then a, a gold Alfa Romeo comes around and also fucking drifts. Pathetic. Absolutely pathetic. But, you know, some things you look back on, you just piss yourself laughing, you know? Absolutely piss yourself laughing. It, terrible, really. Terrible. Shouldn't have told you. Sh I shouldn't have told you, really, should I? What about a fucking full... Oh, my... Oh, it looks... It's inside as well. Oh, yeah, we got to have that. Just purely for the... Uh... Yeah, we got to have that. It's still in the C-Class, so that's fine. Weight reduction. That's going to push it right up. Oh, the good old days, yeah. Yeah, now, I mean, I would never dream, uh, literally never dream of doing anything like that. No. It's, it's when you're young, Here's isn't it, you, you know? you fiddle with your drivetrain so you can actually put all that power down. It's when you're young. There's something about being young, isn't there? You think you're the bollocks, you know. But I did used to... Um, you definitely need a road cage in your car. <laughs> yeah, exactly. Don't unsub because of that. Fucking your bone. Um, I've had so much fun in cars, though, honestly. I used to love my Capris. I've had nine. Uh, if anyone lives local to where I am, does anyone know the, the South End Cruise or the Lakeside Cruise? The Lakeside Cruise. In the chat now, does anyone know what I'm talking about with Lakeside Shopping Centre Cruise every last Saturday of the month? Does anyone fucking know, you know? <coughs> Mini Metro, oh god, yeah, they would definitely. Right, I want to know, because if not, I'm not going to bother. Don't just put yes. Race clutch, do we want that? Shift to, oh, look at that, yeah, we're definitely having that. Full ratio. I ain't too fussed about that, but it's not, it's not pushing it up too much. Final drive, we'll have that. Essex boys. <laughs> Every last Saturday of the month. Um, how often are you going to stream? Or, oh, or, or, yeah, I don't know, uh, Jolly. They, it'll come and go. It'll come and go. Exactly. We used to, uh, there was a McDonald's there, and there was a huge, as there is now, uh, Medway Monkeys. <laughs> there was a massive shopping centre, as there is now, obviously, but at the car parks at the back, not the main lakeside, all the car parks. Um, used to, yeah, I had a CRX up for I was going to tell you about that. Um, they used to have, um, just uh, on a Saturday, it was, it was the bollocks, let me tell you. And it wasn't full of shitty Novas. There would, it was a bit like Chelsea Cruise. Um, now you can't claim to be a computer geek with your Anstrad and the Yobbo. No, I've been a bit of everything, you know. Now I'm me. I've literally been a bit of everything. Every last Saturday, 
Lakeside Shopping Centre, um, hundreds of cars, not just shitters, right? Not just fucking, uh, you know, anything. Ferraris, Lamborghinis, it was it was beautiful. People would um, just, it was one of them times in your life, you know? It f always felt sunny, it always felt like you'd been cleaning your car all day. Everyone's car just looked the bollocks, and it was really, really nice. And that lasted for about, oh, I don't know, what felt like about six months. Then the shitters started to turn up, right? More and more cozies getting fucking ripped by people, just flying round the roundabouts. The Ferraris and Lambos, they went. Instantly they went. They're not going to fuck around with that, are they? And then I remember being fucking by the, just by a roundabout, watching the Sierra just go past. It was stupid. Absolutely stupid. But the last night, there was police everywhere. There was fucking police helicopters above us. Everyone was running for their cars because no one had insurance or tax back then, did they? Did they? Uh, we just all ran into our cars. It was just fucking mental. But good times. Good fun times, you know? Absolute fun times. Chelsea Cruise. That was, that was every second wednesday night in london in chelsea fucking brilliant that was that was mostly american cars so I, I used to go to all the car cruises all of them you know um and yeah i had an xr4i i had an xr4i let's just go for the sport diff i'm trying to keep it in c um yeah timed out that's all right well i'll get back in in a minute i had an xr4i bright red of course um that was a beautiful car, a tea cutted and polished and polished every single bit of that. Uh, and my mate had a standard Sierra, and <laughs> he says, uh, I really fancy lowering my car. I'm like, oh yeah, he went, will you come round and help me? Yeah, of course I will. Went round there, expecting some sort of suspension kit, right? He jacked it up, using the original fucking Sierra thing, and you have to really put your choice properly where you're gonna have your jack because it will just fucking pop through the through the floor so we've jacked it up like this i'm like what bitch you got then and he's went Zzz! he's got a fucking angle grinder and basically just just cut the spring in half and lowered it all down oh my god did it look the bollocks but you would literally be driving in his car <laughs> like this it was so bouncy it had nothing um i couldn't resist it i did it to mine as well but <laughs> but not as low as his um a little bit like that and uh we we was just driving <laughs> along like this looking at each other oh it's fucking the best honestly and i'll tell you what how lowering changes the profile of the car just fucking awesome but you you would be driving along like this literally i'd get a fucking headache just by it, it was crazy yeah forget all them lowering kits just fucking like that and just drop it down and then he did his too low he was one of them people that would have to like there's a speed ramp and he would have to go over it like really to the right all to the left but you can do it you can just cut it down but there's no there's no suspension or fuck it just going out like this and uh, i did that and my missus that's when i first met my missus and we're driving along like this i had to get rid of it and now though seriously not messing about the xr4 i was second best to what i really wanted was a cosworth <laughs> horror stories i know have a look on ebay now and see how much an xr4 i is it's crazy money absolutely crazy money and it was the same engine as a 2.8 capri it was a 2.8 but really slow and the flywheels used to get stuck on as well. So you'd be putting your foot down and you just hear, it sound like a jet. It be, and I didn't have any money to change it back then, you know? Although I did attempt that on my Manta. Did you really? Such a cheap way of lowering it. I think it would even work now. I mean, I had a Passat a few years ago, one of the newer ones, and I did pay quite a little bit of money to have it lowered um, by about three quarters of an inch. And even that just changed the profile beautifully. But I think you could just get an angle grinder and pop a bit off the uh, all four of the springs. Fucking away you go. Brilliant, you know. <coughs> well, you did it as well, sir. See, it's fine. <laughs> well, you had to a little bit. Well, I had speakers. I was. Uh, that's why I'm half deaf now. Yeah, the Opel Manta was a nice car actually. Uh, again, have a look now. The Opel Manta wasn't. Um, St spring compressor yeah oh well you could get that actual that's it that's come back to me actually scarab yeah you could get clamps couldn't you to clamp them together and i think that's where we got the idea of what uh, yeah i don't want to buy clamps but i've got an angle grinder yeah am i am i just talking shit here did they have comp spring compressors that you could actually
clamp onto your spring and spring them together. I'm sure they did. Yeah, and we just thought, well, why do that when you can just get an angle grinder, you know? Right, differential. I think we're all right here. <laughs> He's going to move onto his experience of wearing a dress. No. MOT failure, yeah. Well, I knew a garage. It's fine. Thank you for subbing, mate. Yeah, I knew that. My go-to car... Yeah, my go-to car, I like the RS um, 1600, and I also like the Ferrari Testarossa, because that's my go-to car in real life, if I wish, you know? Exactly, Pete, exactly. Well, you know I can fucking talk for England, can't I? And as long as you're all right, I'm all right. I think we're done here. How... Okay, one question for those tuners out there. Here's one for you tuners. How much leeway have I got on, on the seat? Thank you uh, for subbing. Couldn't resist the Capri stream. I know, yeah. Hello Rover, Rovers, how you doing? Again, Triumph Dolomite, not my sort of car, but try and find one now. What's happened to these cars? Yeah, what has happened? I mean, I always wanted a Cosworth and I uh, just couldn't afford one. And now I definitely can't afford one. I'm going to go here because I want to push it right up to the top uh, of C-Class. So we might as well, we might as well just fucking have it. Here we go, we're reaching the, the max now. Five nine nine. That's it. We're done. I might keep it orange. Yes, I might keep it orange. Uh, view basket. Buy and install parts. Taking up to up to five nine nine. Ain't got a problem with that. Cosworth's beautiful. I'll just quickly tell you this, right? Because I have told this quite a lot, and it's you know a car experience that stayed with me. I've done the supercar experiences, right? forget that my bloke that i worked for at the time i worked in car yards right i was a cleaner right i used to clean clean cars and then i worked up to running one of the car yards but at this particular time i was a cleaner my my pride and joy my capri was parked in the corner i never let anyone fucking drive my car i used to tell it wait be careful mind that don't slam the door don't touch that that mind your foot there i was always terrible like that he had a white two-door Cosworth that was race-tuned. You know when people say, oh, I've got 500 horsepower there, 600. It, it was a genuine. He used to drive it up to Essex once every six months to be totally rebuilt because it was a race engine. Uh, and he said to me, he knew I loved his car. I loved it with a passion. It was pearlescent white as well. It was beautiful. Absolutely beautiful. It was, he didn't really look after it as such. It wasn't his pride and joy. He had a bit of money and he just always wanted a Coswell. And he says to me, uh, will you clean my car this afternoon? Of course I will. That's not a problem. I fucking love cleaning the Cosy. And he went, I'll tell you what, I've got to go. He used to have another shop as well. He said, I've got to go. Can I take your car? And then you drive that up when you're done. And I was like, one part of me went, yeah, but you won't look after my baby. Like, you know, this is my pride and joy. My, it was like my Amstrad of the computer days. That was my baby. I give him my key. And I sort of thought, oh, hang on a minute, though. I can drive there. I can even smell the interior. It was just beautiful, full leather. Um, and I went, all right, anyway, I bushed through the cleaning. Because the more I was cleaning, I was thinking, fucking hell, I'm going to drive this beast in a minute. Uh, when... Drove it out, right, really careful like this. Oh, the sound of it. And I, had, I mean, my car's got a dump valve on it. Probably because of this particular day. This car had a dump valve on it, but fucking hell, it would shit everyone up as you go along the high street. Right, got out onto the high street, that's fine. It started accelerating, thinking, oh, okay, well, this isn't as, you know, and obviously I'd never driven a turbo car before. And sometimes, depending on how you tune these bastard cars, they do have a bit of lag, don't they? When got to what's called Chatham Hill, right? If anyone knows, got to Chatham Hill, I let the traffic go, and I put my car, put my foot right down, and once the lag just started to spin up, I, c I just literally it will always stay with me. Literally, fucking hell! It, it was so fast. Oh my god! And the dump valve was so loud. This was a proper race tuned five six hundred brake horsepower two door Cosa. Unbelievable, and it stayed with me. And uh, the, the feeling of just I, not, I almost killed myself I think the car was dirty by the time I dropped it off and I'm sh I swear he looked at it with fucking steam coming out the bonnet oh it just stayed with me forever and I've always wanted a Cosworth probably from that moment and only the last couple of years about three years ago I got my car it's a turbo one of the first things I wanted on there was it was a dump valve yeah it was a whiplash it was dangerous as fuck how he just let me get in there I don't know but and how I didn't kill myself, you know. 
Right, okay, that's, um, I think we're done here. Let's have a little drive around. Let's start a new session. This has been a proper rambling stream, and I'm sorry about that. Look at the roll bar. I'm not sure about the roll bar. I'm not sure about the roll bar. Let's have a look. That might have to come out. It, oh, look at that. Oh, it looks good, though, doesn't it? Look at that. Yeah, sorry about the rambling, if, you, if you're not into that. Sometimes that's what you get here. Now, come back into the stream. I see, you should be able to join the convoy. Let's go for a drive. <clears throat> and that was my car shenanigans, so... Oh yeah, this is good. <laughs> Codus has been... Yeah, you've seen a different side to me today, haven't you? Astro Mark II GTE with the digital dash? Is it got the digital dash? And you could ship people up and change it from kilometres to miles. And so you're doing like 180 miles an hour. <laughs> uh, you're on a new leader. To cancel your current and start playing Horizon Live together. Okay, do that. That's fine. Yeah, I'm not sure about the roll bar. The roll bar might have to go. It's ruined. Fuck. Oh, we've got to take off over there. Hold up. Yeah, hold up. We're going back here. It was an ugly digital dash, though. It wasn't the best one, was it? <laughs> I've seen you floss. Well, here we go. Oh, yes. Well, you should be able to join me now. <laughs> Whatever takes the attention of your driving. For fuck's sake. Jesus Christ, Phoenix. You, whose bed did you get out of the wrong side? This feels really nice, actually. Nah, this is a Mark 1 Capri. That was a Mark 3. <laughs> Yours. You fucking wish. Alright, you're not on, on online mode. Let's get in here. Play online. Bosh, done. Here you go. So you should be able to join me now. No, it will now, Luke. It will now, mate. Oh, it handles really nice, actually. And that's without tuning. Oh, God, this is awesome. Oh, fucking hell, I was reading the comments then. The <laughs> and I ended up in the river. That's, isn't it funny though, right? I literally read a comment. I'm, dri I'm driving along the road. And I fucking ended up in the river. How true to life that can be. Never fuck about with your phone in the car. Terrible, isn't it? Literally, I just read. I love the Capri, but I can't help myself. American. <laughs> Splash. I'm gone. That's a proper lesson, isn't it? <laughs> I wasn't expecting the river. Nor was I. Nor was I. This is why you shouldn't read and drive, isn't it? <laughs> Yeah, just come and join me, because look, we've got a convoy going now. That's alright, Sovereignty, it's all good. It's fine, it's not real life. This is feeling really good, actually. Really good. Too much. I wish I had a little bit more control on the handbrake. It has, yeah, it's got the awesome stereo, hasn't it? There's the stick, man. No, I'm happy with this. This could be a little go-to car. It handles really well, actually. It feels planted, which is one one thing that um, some of the cars have difficulty with in Forza Horizon. Feel, feeling planted. Carpets are gonna stink, yeah. Tag on his joint. Now it's a tag on. Fuck 
fuck's sake! <laughs> look, you <laughs> got the old Capri. Here we go. Look, awesome. Has Matty got one as well? This is like the Capri meat, isn't it? Stay there. I'll fucking drone it. Stay there. Let's have. Let's see what this drone thing's like. Can we do that anywhere? Let's have a look. Yeah, let's fucking go into drone mode. Whoa, whoa, whoa. How do you... Hang on. How do you turn it around, though? WASD. How do you actually turn it around? Uh, is it like that? Oh, okay. I know space lifts it... Oh, it's cursor keys, isn't it? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Of course it is. Right, let's go back. Let's have a look at the Caprice. I quite like the drone mode. I just wish it would go up higher. I mean, that is pretty much it. Here we go. <laughs> oh my god! Oh, I tell you what, it's done quite a good. It's it's a good damage model, isn't it? It is a bloody good damage model. Look at the ripples. And I did say ripples in that bonnet. Look at that. Oh, Matt, who's right inside me there? <laughs> He's right inside me. It's pretty cool, that. Oh god, I do like this game. I do. It's, it's got a lot of fun. I just can't believe how graphics are coming on now. Look at that metal. I mean, it's you can't tell it from real life, can you? The reflection and the way it just looks. Amazing, really, isn't it? Absolutely amazing. I think so, Fez. It's just fun, isn't it? You know? Nice one. Yeah, silver one does look good, yeah. Should we, um... We've got 2 minutes 55. Let's do that. Okay, Jason. Let's do that. I've updated your route to the Forza on Live event now. Come to the Forza Live event. I don't know. Just follow me. Just follow me, lads. It'll be fine. I'm hoping it repairs my car. In 400 for me. yards. Turn left. <laughs> What's happened there? It's just like random cars. Right, we're gonna have this Forza on, and then uh, I'm gonna call it a day. I'm gonna set up. I've got a couple of jobs to do, and set up for Turn tonight. Left. We're playing Gran Turismo tonight. It will be more serious than this. Not the stream, but the racing. The stream won't be more serious. It will always be a fuck around. Always. Sorry. Come to the Falls of On. We've only got like two minutes to get it. Hurry up, quick. Oh, come on. This game is so cool. I'm really, really looking, already looking forward to what DLC. I just hope they keep the DLC, like the last Forza Horizon. They did Hot Wheels tracks. I don't want that. I want them to keep. I want them to give me more of England, you know, or, or the UK. <laughs> exactly, Phoenix. Yeah, follow me. Come on, this falls upon. It's um Royal tonight. GR4. Oh shit. Funnily enough, when I had my standard Capri, right, and this is totally standard, it was only it was only three or four years old when I got it, it was an absolute beauty. Um, no, it must have been late, it must have been older than that. Anyway, I had this Capri. I was driving through London, and no word of a lie, right, it started spitting, and it wasn't it wasn't big at all. It wasn't big. And the arse just just it was a fucking dangerous car actually the Capri. The arse end just just lost it and I spun around in the middle of the street and I wasn't at that particular time doing absolutely anything. I wasn't doing anything wrong. I was I was just driving absolutely normal. Um, and the arse just spun out, you know? Crazy little car really. Uh, just go to the um look in the pin messages, uh, it's all in there. In GT Sport. Oh yes, get that arse end down. And look at these graphics though, absolutely stonking, isn't it? But the car is GR4 and uh, Dragons. <coughs> nice easy one, doesn't even need any, any practice. Right. Doesn't even need it. <laughs> turn sharp right. In 100 yards, turn left. Here we go, we're going for the falls of one. What, what happens? What, 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 what? Are we here or. 
Do we have to press anything to enter? Oh no, we're in it now, okay. So we've got a group progress through these, uh, yeah, okay. Theme park, how you doing? Neon, American muscle. <laughs> Neon, have another look, mate. Dagenham muscle, right? Dagenham muscle. American muscle, my arse. This is a full Capri, mate. How are you, theme park? Matty's car just went everywhere. Round one complete. Thank you for something. Two. Get to round two. Okay. We're, okay. Up here. No, Neon. No, you're wrong. No, it didn't. Oh, come on. They had the Mustang, didn't they? They're not going to want our shit, are they? Turn around when it is safe to do so. Um, so where are we actually going then? Where... What's this purple marker? Is that is that where we're going? Yeah. Oh, we're doing we're in a little drift zone. Oh, okay. Oh, that yeah. Good luck with that. Neon, I apologise then, mate. I apologise. Four hundred yards. Turn right. What if I didn't spot that sarcasm. Fucking drift then. I'm terrible at drifting. Really bad. That's more handbrake turn, isn't it? It's this car, I blame the car. It's not set up for drifting, that's what it is. Yeah, that's what it is. Yeah, it's not drift it's not set up, is it? Well. I know cuz, but I've got to start it up, haven't I? Actually, more than likely, just ruining everyone else's trips, <laughs> which is making me laugh. It just goes. It just goes. Yeah, once that starts to slip out, though. Oh fucking hell! <laughs> I hate this drifting section. Almost there. Almost. Almost, yeah. It doesn't really drift this car. Turn around when it is safe to do so. I can drift in real life. <laughs> Recalculating route. Right, we're moving on then, aren't we? <coughs> round two complete! Round two, Get where are we going? Which is where? Is that up here? Yeah, it must be up here, isn't it? Where that waypoint is. Oh, is this just the waypoint? No, that's not it. That's not it. 
<laughs> There's American muscle cars. <laughs> yes, John. How are you, John Fisher? Telling me to turn around. I don't think I have. I think that's just the waypoint. I think I'm in the wrong place. He loved this digital land. It's. I tell you what, Sovereign. Honestly, it's not a bad representation. It really isn't. Some parts are really good, actually. Turn some parts. Some parts so. are a little bit. Um, could be anywhere in the world, you know. Not necessarily just the UK, it could be anywhere. Turn around when it is safe to do so. I don't know why she's <laughs> dead. I don't know why she's telling me to do that. Because we've got a speed thing here, haven't we? All right, here we go. <laughs> yeah, rock. American cars, aren't they? Yeah, I'll get it now. I'll get it now. I'll get it now. Right, dodge the car. Ouch! <laughs> I like the way it's got auction written over it. Like, oh yeah, I fancy buying that car now. Oh, for fuck's sake! I thought it was ghosting, wasn't it? Vicky King. Yes, I can. This is only the second Forza Fawn I've ever done. Turn around when it is safe to do so. Well, as I always say, uh, everyone's a critic. So, what can I do? What can I do? I'm going to dodge that rock again. This isn't the drifting section anyway. Sweet. <laughs> this is high speed, believe it or not. We've almost done it. Here we go. Round, Round three complete. complete. Round three. Is that it? <clears throat> hey, look at Luke's car. Fucking hell. That's pretty sweet, isn't it? To be included in the game as well. That is cool. And I used to have this, um, <laughs> I used to have this horn on my real Capri. I'm joking, I'm joking. Wish I had a Mark II. No, I had a Mark II. I didn't like it, I didn't like it, yeah. Yeah. Right, that is it, everyone. Um, it's 11 o'clock. Uh, just need to turn traffic, traffic off. Yeah, yeah, maybe. Look at this. Oh, who's that one? That's a Lee Cobra. There's some awesome cars in this, isn't it? And then you get monkey pull up. Oh, no, 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 that is a bit of, bit of traffic. I thought that was monkey. In just a Merc come up with C-Class. Right, that is it, everyone. Thank you for joining me. You never know. You never know. I might pop back up a little bit later for a cheeky stream. Um, but if not, I'll be back tonight. Um, I'm going to look at a secondary school tonight. So if... <laughs> look at the steering wheel, look. Who the fuck was that? I'm going to look at school for Max tonight. So This is like Gran Turismo all over again gonna look at school tonight so I might be a little bit late but I think I'd definitely be on by nine o'clock and we will have time for one awesome round of uh, GT Royale with Grand Turismo that's it everyone have a lovely day I might pop up later on you never know I'll see you later have a lovely day everyone see you later